what's up world and fellow youtubers it's me elric here on the tech of tomorrow youtube channel bringing you guys yet another unboxing what are we taking out of the box today well today we'll be taking a look at the pny gtx 650 ti now this is pretty much an entry level video card for gamers from the people over at nvidia it's well priced it's been pretty well received by all the market and the one i have today just happens to be from pny now back in the day PNY used to be one of the absolute biggest memory companies around. If anybody went back in the day to Circuit City or any of these other old computer companies used to be around, these guys were the main brand. Well now, like anybody else, they've treaded the river of change and they've moved into graphics cards. And so we've got one of those and let's pop this bad boy open. I've got the trusty knife right here. You guys can see now this thing's completely in its sealed package. And so here I'll just show you guys the back of the box. And now let's just transition over to the table and let's open this bad boy up. All right, folks, so here we got it. I'm gonna go ahead and take the trusty knife, make a slit across the top there. I'll be like a Christmas kid and open this up. I have its packaging, get it out of the way. Okay, up here on top though, they do have some things called their added value. They have movie night. You can choose from a bunch of different titles. You get a free Panda and Monk pet coupon inside, which is a World of Warcraft thing. That's pretty cool because a lot of people like that shit. You get free three-month subscription to ESEA. That's all pretty good stuff. So beyond that, let's just bang the bad boy out. Now their cards are a little bit different. These guys are always based on the reference design, but that can be a good thing for many reasons. So open the pop here. Now for one thing, people talk a lot of shit about reference designs many times, but with the reference design card, if you're gonna be doing any modifications, going out and getting a water cooler usually the easiest way to get that done is by buying a reference based card now if you don't want to screw with it at all then you want to look for something with some extremely crazy cooling you know like something by you know msi zotac or asus but uh you know these guys do a really good job and those ones i named off are the guys who do you know nvidia cards there are other companies out there I'm not trying to diss on those guys so here's this now can't show you guys the number but there's a number under here and it says you have the weapon. Now get your free Panther and Monk. What? Oh, no! Okay, all right. So here we go. DVI to the VGA connector. Out of the way. Molex to six pin. Out of the way. Mini HDMI to standard HDMI. Out of the way. Now it says it comes with a couple different brackets. I don't happen to see those in there, but uh, flip this thing around here you guys can see it says it's supposed to come with a bunch of different little brackets so maybe you can use it for like low profile but uh, i don't think so the card looks too big so now let's get to the card now this card is very very small so let me bring it up here here's the hand of me here's the card hand card hand card single fan Flip it around, rear I.O., two DVI, mini HDMI, very simple. Flip it around the back. You guys can see this card's about probably about an inch, inch and a quarter wide. It's probably about almost five inches long. I don't know what the heck I did with my damn measuring thing today. Now, underneath here, we see the single six pin power connector right here. Flip it around. Back of the card, PCIe interface right there. It's on a black PCB. A lot of people prefer that in their systems. And that's pretty much it. So that's it, folks. I hope you guys like this video. PNY is a very well-priced card. This thing's probably gonna run very quiet and very cool since it's one of the entry-level cards. It's not gonna have too much boom to make it run hot, but it'll still probably perform very well. I'm now gonna go take it, throw it in my test system, run a bunch of benchmarks, and then we'll bring you the full review. Also, I know a lot of you guys in the past said with the other channel that I was doing that we did a lot of unboxings, not as reviews. We're going to try to and pick that up. I may even hire another guy to actually work with me on the channel and do it and bring you guys more videos. So we're going to try to pick up the speed around here. If you guys like the video, please hit that like button. Always makes my heart appreciate it. Also, we have lots of giveaways and stuff going on. So make sure you hit the sub button so you don't miss out on anything. Like usual, if you're interested in purchasing this card or anything else, please take a look in the link in the description below. Peace out, brothers.